Module 2. Identifying which search tool to use when searching the University Library's collections. The goal of this module is for the viewer to be able to identify and choose the appropriate search tool to use when searching the University Library's collections. Located on the library's website, libraries.psu.edu, is a collection of research tools tailored to meet the individual needs of our patrons. Understanding the function of these tools will help you to answer questions our patrons may have about the collections and enable you to provide our patrons with excellent patron service. The first tab, Books, Articles, and More, allows you to direct a patron to Lion Search or the Cat. When you type in a search term in the search box, it searches Lion Search. For example, if I were to search Nutella, I would get approximately 9,310 results. I can narrow my search down by including items with full text online or excluding newspaper articles. I can also choose the type of content and the subject terms. As I scroll down the page, I can adjust the publication date, the location of the library I would like to use, so if I only want to search through collections at the library I'm located at, I can do that. I can also choose the language of my work. This will help narrow down a search to only relevant sources. If Lion Search does not provide the results the patron needs, another tool to search our collections is the cat. Click on the link for the cat located under the search box for Lion Search. It will take you to a quick search where you can search by keyword, browse to begin with a letter or word, or an exact word match. The drop down menu provides you with options for searching, for example, author or title. You can also narrow your search to a particular library. The CAT also enables you to complete an advanced search for your research. Clicking on the Advanced Search link on the right-hand side opens up several search boxes that will help you in narrowing the search down. There is also a great link located in the blue menu for help. This will explain the various searches and give tips on how to better utilize the CAT. You can also complete a Begins With or Browse search. This search brings you an alphabetical list of titles, authors, journal titles, series, or subjects that match the words you've typed in. Use the Browse or Begin With search when you know the exact name or first words of what you are searching for. If I were to search for math and click on Titles, catalog items containing math in the title would appear. Clicking on a link takes me to the items for review. For example, link number two has math with 18 results. If I did not get an item that was useful to my search, I could continue searching in Lion Search, World Cat, Hattie Trust Full Text, Google Books, Google Scholar, or UBorrow. Those links are located on the right hand side of the page. There are also options to limit the search results. Also on the right hand side of the page under Catalog Searches, on the Quick Search page, you can do a call number search, so you can browse an inventory of each library's holdings in call number order. Browsing by call number allows you to quickly see a library's holdings in a specific call number area, and if you know the exact call number, you can search to find the item. The second tab is Databases. Sometimes, patrons will need a starting point in their research. On this tab, there is a link to try these first. This link will take you to book and background sources and article sources, including the Academic Search Complete and the Access World News Newsbank. To help with research basics, you may want to show patrons the Research Basics Guide and the Citation and Writing Guides located under More Help. To search the databases provided to you by the University Libraries, you can type in the name of your database and click Search, or if you know the name of the database, you can click on the first letter of the name of that database. To search e-journals or electronic journals, you can search using four different options, title begins with, title equals, title contains all words, or ISSN equals. You can also browse e-journals by title. Once you have begun your search, you can then narrow the search down to subject area and e-journal only or e-book only. Many faculty members choose to place material on reserve in order to ensure that all students in their class have access to it. The Course Reserve tab allows you to search by course number, by instructor, or by course name to locate materials that have been placed on hold for a class to have access to. If you have problems searching, the question icon allows you to get course reserve help, including help in finding the exact number and name of a course as it appears in the university course listings. The final tab allows you to search the entire library's website. 
You can click on the question icon and you will be given tips on searching. So if you're not finding what you're looking for, try a different search technique. While this is only a brief introduction to research tools located on the library's website, your knowledge of them will help you to continue to provide our patrons with excellent service.